Matthew Eady is best known as the posh pescatarian and she's filming the second season of her show and she's stopping by New Orleans this morning and she has a great recipe for us. Stephanie, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you as well. Thanks for having me. And I had to admit that I'd never heard of a pescatarian before. What is a pescatarian? That's really common. So pescatarians are basically vegetarians who supplement their diet with seafood. Uh -huh. It's a plant-based diet with seafood. So you're a vegetarian but you have uh, seafood in there as well. That's right. And how did you get in involved in that? I started having issues with digestion about 15 years ago. And I won't go into detail, but I was working with a nutritionist and we started eliminating things from my diet. And as we started bringing them back in, we landed on the pescatarian lifestyle as the best fit for me. And how did it help you? Oh my gosh, I am the most vibrant, lively person ever. I've got a clean bill of health. I just feel overall just really, really fantastic. And tell us about your show on the Z Network. Yeah, so my show is on Z Living. Season one is on the air now. We're mm -hmm. now here in New Orleans to film two episodes from season two. Oh. So very excited about that. And uh, you're going to make some, uh, some a recipe for us right now? I'm making a recipe for you that I discovered while in Mexico for season one. Mm -hmm. It is a easy shrimp taco with a jicama taco shell and a papaya salsa. Oh, it looks good. Have you ever had jicama? Uh, yes, I have. Okay, it's it, fantastic. Uh -huh. I love to use it as a taco shell. And that's the, the jicama right here. This, it, it looks like root, a root. It's a big root vegetable similar to the turnip. Uh -huh. Tastes a whole lot better. Uh, and so what we do is we peel this, we get this onto our mandolin, slice it really thin, and once you do that, it looks like this, paper oh, thin. look at that. And if you're lucky, they'll turn out perfectly round. If not, you know you'll get a version of it. It looks like it. a taco shell. Exactly, oh that's the goodness. idea. So we've got a really easy uh, papaya salsa here, red onion, cilantro, salt, papaya, super simple. We've got some local shrimp, uh -huh. and we've got our uh, taco made here. Here is the shrimp, and here is a taco if you'd love to taste it. So it's just, oh, I'd love to. <laughs> Let me see, well, I guess I have to use my fingers because we, <laughs> no we don't have a fork. And Let me tell you what it tastes like. Trying to get a little, a little bit of everything in here. Okay. Mmm. It's fresh. It's delicious. I can taste the cilantro. Yep. Mmm. Thank you very mm. much. My body is saying thank you, thank <laughs> you, thank you. This is delicious. Thank you. Now, why did you choose New Orleans to come here to, to film a show? It's a city of food, among mm -hmm. other things. And I love seafood, and this just seemed like the best place for me. And all of the sort of beautiful people here were mm -hmm. welcoming to me. I've got a lot of sponsors here, and they've been really great to me. And how can people find your show? Oh, you can find me everywhere, YouTube, Instagram, Facebook. And if you go on Z Living's Network, you can find all of my information to uh, contact me. Are all of your recipes this easy? Most of them are. That's the whole lifestyle is about simple, easy, delicious, fresh, and local, so these French, these fish, uh, these shrimp made a lot of sense. And posh. And posh. How did you come up with the posh pescatarian? My friends were joking around and they gave me that name. Uh -huh. And it just stuck and I liked it and uh, I've been using it ever since. Well, this is to die for right here. Thank you. And you can check out the posh pescatarian on the Z Living Network. Yep. Just check your local cable provider to find out what station it's on. And thank you so much. We're going to be back here in the kitchen right after, at the end of the show. But right now, let's go to Dave.